Hi, so this is just a quick preview of what the completed project will look like. This project has three steps. When you complete the first step, uh, you will have this transformation showing a, a box here. And I can rotate this box by moving my uh, clicking and dragging my mouse to the left and right. And I can also drag up and down and rotate it this way. Uh, and then I can hit the control key uh, and then click and drag to zoom in and out. So this is just the first part of the project. Um, and of course, these other things will start working here as well. You can um, enable or disable showing the box and you can uh, turn on auto rotation, which starts rotating the box. All right, so the next step is displaying a 3D object. For that, we're going to open an OBJ model. And when we open our OBJ model, um, here, let's say open the teapot, and our project will display the triangular mesh of this OBJ model of this uh, teapot. Uh, so this is going to be uh, what you're going to see when you complete the second step of the project. You're going to be displaying this 3D, um, 3D model. Then the third step, we're going to display a texture on this model. And we can pick whatever texture we like, and we just open an image file um, like so. And when we do that, that image texture will appear on our model. Uh, here's another thing um, here that could be important, depending on what kind of OBJ file you load, you may want to swap the Y and Z axes of, of the model. Uh, that's another functionality that you will need to implement. And of course, we have this other functionality here that um, turns on and off the texture display. Oh, there it is.